Hello everyone. In this video, I will explain difference between call by value and call by address in C programming language. So, in order to show that difference, uh, let's create a uh, function first. So, uh, the function we are creating with name change, and in this function, we are passing one argument. And what we are doing here is that we are changing this value to 30. So this is a very simple function with void data return data type. It means this function is not going to return any type of value. And this function need one parameter. And this function is actually assigning 30 to that past parameter. So here uh, what we will do here now we will declare a variable and we will assign value 120 and here we will print value of this variable a with uh, message before calling function so this printf statement will print a line before calling function and it will print value of a and here we will call that function we will pass a variable value and then again we will print so what we want to see here is that uh, before passing the variable value in that function we are printing the value and after passing after calling that function we, we are again printing the value so we want to see whether the changes made by this function is permanent or not so let's see the execution i have saved this file with st.c i will this file is saved on desktop so i need to change my directory to desktop and then I will compile this one using GCC compiler. I am showing this example on Ubuntu operating system. So let's run this program. Okay, uh, let me give here new line for more readability. So we will again compile here and we will run it. So here, if you can see, uh, before calling function, it is showing value is 120 and after calling function again value is 120 so the reason for this behavior is that when we pass any parameter so we are passing here a so whenever a parameter is passed in a function actually a one copy of this variable will be created and that copy will be passed in this function so if this function is making any changes those changes actually performed on duplicate copy not on the original variable that's why this function is actually changing value to 30 but those changes actually not performed on original variable so this is known as call by value so how it works variable is passed and uh, uh, at the time of passing one copy of that variable is created and that copy is actually passed in function so if a function is making any changes in it its parameter those changes are not on original data so that's why those change will not affect this original variable now we will see uh, call by address so in call by address actually instead of passing data we will pass address of that variable so let's see how is that thing is done so here actually and now we are passing pointer so in that case we need to change this type uh, let me first create a pointer here int star p equal to a so uh, and here we will pass p so here we are passing the pointer okay so uh, this function uh, taking a parameter of pointer data type that's why we need to change this so we are saying now this function actually need a pointer type of variable in parameter list 
so now x is a address now uh, in order to dereference this operate uh, address the operator is star x equal to 30 so uh, what is the meaning of this statement is that so here actually what we are passing here we are passing a pointer and that pointer is actually having a address like this p is actually having a address of a so star x the meaning of this statement is that whatever address is passed in this function the uh, location pointed by this variable which is a address is store on that address this value 30 so if we write here x so x will actually a address x will uh, x is having a address in it but when we write star x this one is saying address which is stored in variable x on that address is stored 30 so now here uh, if we compile it again and if we run it so we will compile it and run it so here if you can see uh, before calling that function the value is 120 but after calling that function which is called by address value got changed so why is that uh, in first case we have passed our parameter using call by value in which a duplicate copy is passed in function that's why all the changes made by that function is on the duplicate copy not on the original data but in case of second case like call by address address of a variable is passed now we in function we are manipulating that variable with help of address now we are changing the original variable that's why in a function if you want to make any kind of changes permanent we need to pass a pointer so this is the difference between call by value and call by address thank you very much for watching